I hear a lot of people say that Abba Father, our Father in Heaven, doesn't speak to them. Let me just say this. Every single person in this earth, on this earth, God desires to speak to you. He is no respecter of person. He loves all. He created all in his image. So he desires to speak to you. So the first thing you got to do is renounce the lie that God doesn't speak to me. He, he doesn't want to speak to me. <coughs> you might not say it, but you subconsciously believe it. It's time to renounce that lie. I look back at the first time that I heard the father's voice. It was actually in a very quiet place. Knowing um, if you knew me back then, you would have never known me to be quiet. I was always talky, 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 gossip, 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 always doing something, always had music in my ears, always going, 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 going. And it was, I was, I kept myself that way so I wouldn't have to process pain. But let me just say this. I actually went to rehab 11 years ago. I was broken and I was needing I needed a place where I could get whole again and the Lord sent me somewhere. Well, let me just say this. While I was there, I was put on a two-week word fast, okay? What's that? Well, you can't talk for two weeks, okay? When you can't talk for two weeks and, you're, and you've been told you've got to, to write James, the book of James, uh, 50 times, you got to write this book, this book of the Bible this many times, you begin to write it. God begins to speak. The more you get the word in you and the more you silence the voices around you, God will begin to speak to you. The more you get out, get out of the place where you're watching TV every evening. It's not nothing bad, but the if, what we have in our ear is what we're going to hear throughout the day. Say, for instance, if we go home and watch TV all in the evening time and what we love it, we do that. That's what we're going to hear in the day. The more the more what you put in your ears will be what you think about. God is wanting to get your attention and we've got to get quiet. We've got to change our routine to literally position ourselves to hear the voice of the Father. He wants to speak to you. It's not about him. It's on your side. How are you positioning yourself? What are you doing to hear his voice? He's speaking, but are you listening? So I remember in those moments and I thought at first, oh, this is cruel. Why would they put me on a two week word fast? I'm so thankful that I couldn't talk for two weeks because in that moment, I heard the voice of the one who created me in that season, in that time, I heard the father say, I love you and I'm going to breathe life into you. In that moment is where I believed that Jesus was real and that he had a plan for my life. God has a plan for your life. Open the door for him to speak to you. Begin to study the word. Begin to journal the word. Begin to cut out voices while you're in the car. Don't get on the phone talking, but begin to talk to Jesus. Put on the Bible. I hope this blesses you today. God wants to speak to you. Are you listening?